Hi, and welcome to the early years. What an action-packed term we've had, and we look forward to it the last couple of weeks being just as exciting. This afternoon, we have our extracurricular cultural program performance in the pack, and that consists of our students who have been learning the guitar, the piano, and some other stringed instruments. Our choir is also performing too, so it's a great opportunity to come along and see our students perform um, and get a live audience after all this practice over the term. So we're looking forward to a great afternoon and we wish all our students best of luck. I'd also like to remind you of Monday on, that we are hosting the Dolby of Steadford in our MPC. So all our early year students have been busy rehearsing and practicing with Miss Twidale over the term and will be performing from 9.30. So please come along. Now with the uh, Steadford performances, I know Miss Twidale has sent an email with some costume requirements too that students will be needing. If there's any queries there, please be in touch as soon as possible with Miss Twidale or your classroom teacher. Otherwise, students can come to school on Monday already dressed in their Steadford um, costume and just ensure that they've got something to change into later if it's a bit tricky to um, manage um, throughout the learning day. So they're welcome to wear that throughout the day though if it's quite easy to wear. Um, I also wanted to remind you just as the weather really starts to cool down this week to be naming your child's belongings, particularly jumpers and tracksuit pants. We've just noticed that the lost property box is getting pretty full with lots of jumpers who actually don't have names on them. So if you could just take the time this weekend just to have a look at those belongings and make sure that they are all named and labelled ready to bring to school. Finally, I'd just like to mention our learning discussions that we have coming up in week 10. If you'd like to read Mrs Brennan's information in the newsletter today that details what these learning discussions involve and how to book these, please take the time to have a look. If you have any queries though, please feel free to be in touch with your child's class teacher. I'd just like to reinforce though, if you've had been in regular communication or contact and have had meetings with the teacher recently, you may not feel this discussion necessary, necessary and that's fine too. Um, like I said, if in doubt, please contact your class teacher and they can point you in the right direction to booking these meetings or also discussing whether one is relevant. Until next time, 